<laughs> Welcome back, folks, for item two of Ghost Gate. It is the ancient fish pendant, and you're going to want to use your uh, slug. And you, there is a actually, if you look in here too, uh, the bury bark or bury beetle larva for all. Um, and what you, I did here for this one, for the bat, the largemouth and the smallmouth, is I spawned in an, a great parking job. And I just went right next to this truck here and cast it out like I'm normally small mouth fishing at night. Just keep that in mind at night. I'm doing this during the day so you can see a little bit better. Uh, night was definitely better. And also, interestingly, about this mission, that it doesn't seem to be the case for the other ones. That if you catch a smallmouth, for example, on the beetle, it does count uh, on our platform anyway uh, for the other, you know, for your smallmouth on catching it with the rainbow slug. However, I did have better luck on the largemouth with the beetle larva, and I did have better luck with the smallmouth on the, uh, the slug. And then towards the end of the video, you see the spot where you just spawn in here. Uh, to the top spot and then walk over to uh, the area uh, for your um, to get snagged in the will-o'-wisp and once you find that one spot just keep doing it, it might take you a few times uh, to get it it did for me but uh, once you get into a spot where you snag it don't move your pole and you can keep casting in the exact same spot and then make sure you don't forget to go to your druid stone back at uh Texas when you're done. Anyway, hopefully this helps you out, guys. We'll see you next time, folks.